Hey guys, it's Matt. Welcome to Speed Tutor and welcome to the top free assets for May, June 2022. And I feature month on month all the best free assets that you can find in Unity. And we have over 57 awesome assets and we've got so much in here today including props buildings visual effects particles 2d 3d complete game templates and utilities so be sure to stick around watch this video let me know what you think and i'll leave all the links down in the description for you to check them out so be sure to check out my patreon to get access to over 145 different scripts assets and projects you cannot find anywhere else be sure to check out all the links in the description for all the new Humble Bundle and Unity sales, including the brand new Polygon Asset Sale on the Humble Bundle store. Throw a like on this video and don't forget to subscribe. And just before I start, I wanted to mention a really awesome asset called iStep. And this is a foot placement solution, which allows you to bring a little bit more life to characters, whether that be from placing the body or the foot. Because sometimes when you've got your characters, their feet just sort of slide above object, especially when it's higher or lower than the actual player itself. But IK allows you to have the foot always placed exactly where you would expect in real life to make a much more smooth and realistic look, especially when you're going downstairs or going over sort of higher objects and this can really help you do it. The first one is we've got Asset FTTGR, which is a collection of 2D graphics, audios, visual effects, materials, and shaders to create atmospheric scenes. So this includes all the animated characters that you can see, grass, fire, and everything, tile maps, all 8x8 pixel with prefabs, visual effects, 2D environments, audio, loads and loads and loads and loads of detailed assets in here. The next one, is the stylized modular house demo free and this free version includes a bunch of roofs doors houses and modular pieces to create your own stylized environment and it will be part of a bigger pack next we have the hud indicator which is a simple system that allows you to easily configure off and on screen indicators for your game with an easy setup you can do it with split screen support customizable rendering area and you can have a different icon with all the customization. The next one is the top down shooter 3D visual scripting. And this is a complete template built from single touch roguelike top down shooter game using visual scripting. And it has a step by step tutorial for you to get in started with creating this. The next one is called snap to floor. This allows you to take any game object which might be in the air. Press the N key to snap it to the ground and you can use this in Unity 2D or 3D. This may have some tweaks because it is in a language that I don't understand. So it'll be something to take a look at. Next one is Pixel FX Fire. And this is 24 different fire animations with 317 frames with different sprite sheets included for have their own dimensions and have skills suited to a side scrolling project. Next one is Uni To Do, which is the editor to do list. And it allows you to make a simple and complete and customizable to-do list running in the editor. It has all the source code. It requires no editor prefs and no external tools. It can allow you to do titles, tasks, color coding, and everything to manage your productivity in Unity. Next one is Circular, a hyper casual game template, which is a 2D arcade game template with simple taps with a very simple game loop and it's a template for a quick start with any project ideal for a developer that wants to learn any of the simple code base the next one is the little village asset pack which includes benches chairs woods cylinders bottles carts franches different flowers grass houses gardens street lights and trees next one is the homebrew foot ik but this is a free lightweight IK solution, which is fully documented, taken as more of an educational item, which you can learn and take and make the IK specifically for your game release. The next one is the sci-fi post-apocalyptic young male character, which was originally created for a sci-fi horror VR game. And it doesn't include animations or the scene, but you have the character there with all its textures and models. The next one is Tic-Tac-Toe with MinMax AI. And this is an artificial intelligence base for perfectly using a min-max algorithm, specific game of noughts and crosses. And you can add this as a mini game to your own project, learn how to create simple AI algorithm by watching the visualization thinking steps with how the AI does and retracing that in the well-documented code. The next one is the Livecast volumetric video player. And this allows you to play a 3D volumetric video in Unity 
which can be captured in a one VR 180 camera in any environment and it allows you to play that back in VR or any sort of thing whether you want to show it to other people. The next one is the basic move and climb line template and this is a top down solution for you it has clean code, good practices, optimizations and allows you to have basic movement, climbing and things that you can see here. And last but not least is we've got the Kawaii Slime. This is a free cartoon monster creature in an anime style and it contains eight different cartoon slimes with seven different animations for idle walk, jump attack and damage, which is around a thousand triangles and the accessories up to about 390. So be sure to check out all these awesome assets for May, June 2022. Let me know what you think. I'll put all the links down in the description. Be sure to check out my Patreon to get access to over 145 different scripts, assets and projects you cannot find anywhere else. Be sure to come and chat to me on Discord. Check out all the links in the description for all the massive sales on Humble Bundle and the Unity Asset Store. Check out my great assets on the Unity Asset Store along with bonus discounts on my websites for all those fantastic assets. Big thanks to all my patrons for supporting the channel. But a big thank you to Peter Steiner, Raheem Whitaker, David76, Jean Pomier, Manos Vericas, Terence Conrad, Gage Linston, Walter Dunson, John John Games, Joseph Newman, Rene Leisure, Darren M, Topher Chambers, Kreshnik, Halili, and Matthew Cletus. So to everybody else, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Cheers.